good morning kids welcome back to the next session last class what you have learnt yes you have learnt a story okay beautiful end to a childish curiosity okay so i hope all of you have understood the story so today we will start our lesson lesson number 1 red sloppy lips okay children first i'll read the things afterwards i'll explain okay so here see Victor a young boy was riding his bike along an old road and lost his way he stopped and looked around to find his way back how he wished he had brought a friend along just then it began to rain he pulled his jacket up over his head to help keep the rain away but it continued to rain heavily and he became wet his body became numb in the cold rain then it began to thunder so he knew that he must find shelter quickly he saw a dingy big red house and ran on to the porch the wind began to howl and blew so hard that it drove the rain on to the porch soaking victor even more the wind had blown up open the house door so he went inside to get out of the rain the house was very large and though it was abundant dirty and full of cobwebs it kept victor dry so from these paragraphs what you can understand here children see here in this picture what you can see here one boy is there he is nothing but a victor okay he is nothing but a victor and this is his bike okay who was victor yes victor was a young boy what happened one day listen here carefully victor was riding his bike who is riding his bike who was riding his bike yes victor was riding his bike along an old road but what happened he lost his way see here children victor lost his way he has to find his road but he was not getting that road so at that time what happened the rain began and he has to he save himself no he has to save himself from the rain so he pulled his jacket up over his head to keep the rain away see here children you can see in this picture the boy victor he pulled his jacket up over his head to protect himself from the rain but it was raining very heavily and he was become wet in the rain he was become wet in the rain so he wanted to get shelter so he searched a shelter everywhere and all of a sudden he saw a dingy big red house and ran on to the porch here some new words are there children we will know the meanings first then only you will understand the lesson okay see here dingy means what dingy means dark and dirty dingy means dark and dirty and porch means porch means what here porch word is there no porch means a small area at the entrance to a building okay when victor came in front of the porch or entrance here he stood no in front of the house ha huh? this is called as a porch okay when he victor came in front of the porch or a entrance the wind began to make a long loud sound and started blowing so hard so water drops soaking the victor even more okay due to wind door opened see here due to heavy wind the door has been opened so victor went inside to protect himself from the rain see victor went inside the house to protect himself from the rain the house was very large house was very large okay large means big one and abundant 
abandoned here what is there now abandoned means what no longer used means nobody is there in that house okay and means empty house okay so that was very dirty and full of cobwebs okay see here children if your mother is not there in the house one or two days means what was the condition of your house house was become very dirty no yes or no so the house was if the house was no longer used by anyone so that house was no longer used by anyone so house was very dirty and full of cobwebs you know children cobwebs means cobwebs means spider webs okay here you can see here these are called as cobwebs okay so if we will not clean our house weekly or monthly then we can see these spider webs in our house near the corners of the walls okay and see even though victor entered the house see even though victor entered that house to keep himself dry okay i hope all of you have understood this session we will meet in the next class thank you children have a nice day